Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we're taking a look at uh, running AWS in China. So AWS China is the AWS cloud offering in mainland China, and AWS China is completely isolate intentionally from AWS Global to meet regulatory compliance for mainland China. So that means that if you make a workload on the AWS Global, uh, you can't uh, interact with it within the AWS China one, okay? It's basically treated like a, a completely separate service, like AWS has its own Chinese version. Uh, and so AWS China is on its own domain at amazonaws.cn. And for everybody else, that's what's considered AWS Global. So when I'm using AWS from Canada or use it from the US or from India or from Europe or wherever, that is the AWS Global, okay? So in order to operate in AWS China regions, you need to have a Chinese business license, so ICP license. Not all services are available in China, so uh, you will not have the use of Route 53. Uh, and you might say, well, why not just run in uh, uh, Singapore and it was global? And you could do that. But the advantage of running in mainland China means that you would not have to traverse the Great Firewall, okay? So all your traffic is already within China, so you don't have to uh, deal with that. AWS has two regions in mainland China. So uh, there's this one here, which is the Northwest region operated by NSWCF. Uh, and then you have the one in Beijing, North One, operated by uh, Synnet. So, you know, AWS just could not meet the, the compliance requirements. So they had to partner with local providers uh, or data centers. And so that is how that works. Okay.